We're here at the New York Hall of Science where they're busy getting ready for Maker Faire, the annual festival where science, creativity and fun come together. At previous Maker Faires, we saw an awesome science phenomena called the Rubens Tube. Now, the Rubens Tube is a device that plays sound into one end of a tube filled with gas. As the sound waves come through the tube, they push on the air, causing high pressure in some places and low pressure in others, which is how you get this pretty wave shape in the flames. But we wanted to take this a little bit further and see if we could use sound to put out a fire all together. Let's try. So we've got our speaker here pointed at our candle flame and the hope is that the sound coming out of the speaker will displace the air and wipe out our flames. Let's try at 120 hertz. So the sound's coming out but it's not really creating much of air pressure difference. Now let's try again at 23 hertz. And it's affecting the flame enough to blow it out. Yeah. Putting out a fire in this way is almost like blowing out a candle because the sound waves act like multiple regular blasts of air. Sound waves are also pressure waves and as they travel through the air they displace oxygen, the fuel that the fire needs to burn. To see more about how sound can affect fire and other crazy, zany and unbelievable quirks of science, come along to Maker Faire. There's costumes, superheroes, robots of all shapes and sizes, and the interaction of technology and art. There's also food, drinks, and activities for little makers. So come to Make a Fair. It's this Saturday 26th and Sunday 27th of September at the New York Hall of Science in Queens. <laughs>